<clears throat> this is a digital video of the Duplo System 5000 Twin Tower with DBM 400 booklet maker stitch fold and trim and this is the book press installed in between the System 4000 trimmer and 4000 booklet maker and Craig this is a demo run of your system and of course we pull all the covers off you know to make sure that everything's uh, okay there's no issues or problems we like to run it with the covers off uh, basically how the system works is you have two two sets of compression rollers the first set is spring loaded the second set is positive uh, the first set um, it basically feeds it into the second set the first set does crush the book some but then the second set uh, does most of the pushing on the bind and you can see here by looking at the booklet okay what we're running here is nine sheets of 80 pound gloss in a 10 point cover and and it's all long grain too I mean if we were running short grain on the cover at least uh, or short grain the paper you'd have an even flatter looking uh, booklet but that's really a lot better than it would be if you were just trying to run it without the uh, without the fold and of course this the uh, 4000 booklet makers are known for doing a really good job on folding they have six sets of fold rollers uh, I mean three sets of fold rollers six rollers all total plus the trimmer has a crusher on it as well so um, but anyway we're going to go ahead and do the demo run and this is something that we do as a standard prior to shipping the book press runs on 220 volts can be connected separately the connection is right here on the back side of the booklet maker when you plug it in there the 110 volts uh, circuit from the booklet maker turns the book press on you can hear as soon as the set hits the second set of rollers you can feel it and that's about maximum I would say and you look at the way it's set right there while it's coming out of the book coming out of the collator laying pretty flat now I'm gonna I'm gonna lower it down to I'm gonna lower it down to four you can help you can tell by the difference in the sound You can see where it opens up just a little bit more than it did before. But you can tell by the sound if you're if you're getting into too much pressure. So that's like four and a half right there. Okay, this completes our demo run. Okay, so that's what our booklets look like after they're finished. And we've run we've run about oh about 1,500 sets through the system, just mainly double checking everything to make sure that the book press runs and everything runs like it's supposed to, and the book press checks out. We're going to be I think we've already sent you the manuals on the uh, on the uh, operating parts and and service on this unit here. It's pretty simple and straightforward. There's really not a lot to it. As you can see, it's just. Uh, it's very heavily constructed though it's built like a tank but basically it has two you know two sets of cylinders driven by chains and on the other side is the main drive by a motor and it basically just compresses the bind as it comes through the unit pretty straightforward very similar to Borg's design except that the rollers are smaller and closer together which eliminated a lot of the issues and problems that Borg had with theirs because there was too much space between the rollers and the, bo the booklets would have a tendency to ride upward and then uh, buckle the fold going through the second set of rollers so uh, but anyway if you have any questions about this unit please feel free to give us a call uh, we will be packaging it up uh, depending on which one is the best rate we will either ship it crated LTL or we'll ship it padded van Atlas van lines and we'll let you know uh, later to tomorrow 
or Monday which way it's going to go and you'll receive a copy of the bill of lading and so forth uh, when the unit's picked up here. Uh, and if you have any questions, like I said, give us a call. Thank you.